I have a brand new Tudor Pelagos and a brand new Tudor Pelagos 39. And in this video, we are going to do a side by side comparison. Welcome to our channel. My name is Deeb from Gretzella Fine Jewelry. Today's video, we have Tudor Pelagos and the Tudor Pelagos 39. And we're going to do a side by side comparison. I'm actually very lucky that I have these watches together in the same room at the same time. It's very rare that they're still in stock. So as soon as I saw them, I said, I'm going to do a video and here it is. I will keep this video on point. I will unbox these watches for you, show you what comes with them, what's inside of them, give you some specs, not too many, because I know you can get the information out there. But I think the most important part of the video is keeping these watches side by side, showing you how they compare to each other so that you can see which one you may like better. Let's start by unboxing the Tudor Pelagos. Inside the Pelagos box, we have the watch, we have the rubber strap, and we also have the extender for the rubber strap. Now let's unbox the Pelagos 39. Inside the box of the Tudor Pelagos 39, we have the watch. We have a rubber strap that's complimentary. And we also have an extender for the rubber strap. Now that we have the boxes out of the way, let's take a first look at the watches side by side. So from a first initial look, we can see a lot of similarities in these watches. We'll put them side by side so that we can see them better and do a proper comparison. Here they are, one on each wrist. And in the next clips, I'll show you what they look like one by one. This is the Pelagos 39. And this is the Pelagos 42. 39, 42. 39, 42. Pelagos 39. Pelagos 42. So comparing both watches on my wrists, they're obviously fully linked, so they're sitting a little bit lower as usual on my wrist. But to be honest, I like both. I know that's not helping a lot of people, but I think you can get away with either one of them. The Pelagos 42 seems a little bit more rugged. It's a, a little bit more of a strong watch. Whereas this Pelagos 39 is kind of a little bit more refined. You do see a thickness difference in the watches. Because they're made of titanium, they're actually comfortable and light to wear. I know titanium is not for everyone, but they do feel, they do feel nice because they're titanium. This is the Tudor Pelagos 42. This is the Tudor Pelagos 39. There you have it, guys. This is the comparison between the Tudor Pelagos 42 and the Tudor Pelagos 39. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate your time. If you do like the content and if you got some value out of it, please consider subscribing to the channel. It really helps me create the content. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.